and a big jolt for the Congress party again. Senior Congress leader and former Chief Minister of Andhra Pradesh, Kiran Kumar Reddy, has resigned from the Congress and joined the BJP today. The formalization took place a little earlier at a BJP press conference. Listen in. Sabhi media ke saathiyon ka baut baut swagat hai. Aaj amar le badai thoda shant ho jayenge sab log to achha rahega. आज हम सभी के लिए बहुत ही प्रसन्नता का बड़ा हर्ष का पल है कि एक बहुत ही वरिष्ठ देश के राजनेता भारतीय जनता पार्टी परिवार में शामिल हो रहे हैं मित्रों आप नियमित रूप से देख रहे हैं कि राजनीतिक कार्यकर्ता देश भर में भारतीय जनता पार्टी के प्रति उनकी रुचि बढ़ रही है भारतीय जनता पार्टी में नियमित रूप से लोग शामिल होने का सिलसिला चल रहा है और आज माननीय प्रधानमंत्री जी के बहुआयामी नेतृत्व से प्रभावित होकर भारतीय जनता पार्टी की नीतियों से प्रभावित होकर एक बहुत ही वरिष्ठ हमारे नेता किरण कुमार रेड्डी जी आज भारतीय जनता पार्टी में शामिल हो रहे हैं आप सब लोग जानते हैं आंध्र प्रदेश के लंबे समय तक मुख्यमंत्री रहे हैं आंध्र प्रदेश जो यूनाइटेड आंध्र प्रदेश था उसके विधानसभा के स्पीकर आप रहे चार बार विधायक आप आंध्र प्रदेश से रहे हैं भारतीय जनता पार्टी परिवार में आपका बहुत बहुत स्वागत है इस उपलक्ष में भारत सरकार में मंत्री हमारे वरिष्ठ नेता प्रहलाद जोशी जी हम लोगों के मध्य हैं भारतीय जनता पार्टी के राष्ट्रीय महासचिव आदरणीय अरुण सिंह जी हम लोगों के मध्य हैं हमारे ओबीसी मोर्चा के अध्यक्ष भारतीय जनता पार्टी के हमारे वरिष्ठ नेता राज्यसभा के सांसद के लक्ष्मण जी हम लोगों के मध्य हैं भारतीय जनता पार्टी आंध्र प्रदेश के महामंत्री विष्णुवर्धन जी हम लोगों के मध्य हैं सबसे पहले मैं प्रहलाद जी और अरुण सिंह जी से आग्रह करूंगा कि आदरणीय किरण कुमार रेड्डी जी का पार्टी हमें विधिवत स्वागत करें बुके देकर और पार्टी की सदस्यता की पर्ची देकर उनका पार्टी में शामिल करें Right, Madhu Sharma, my colleague is joining us on the broadcast. Madhu, another big jolt for the Congress party. Uh, this was uh, being talked about for quite some time now, but ex uh, uh, former Andhra Pradesh Chief Minister Mr. Kiran Kumar Reddy has joined the BJP, becoming actually the second ex-Congress leader from South India to switch sides in in uh, so many days. <laughs> Is Kiran Kumar already the last Chief Minister of Undivided Andhra Pradesh joined the BJP today? Uh, this came few weeks after he left the Congress Party by sending one line resignation letter to the party chief Malikarjuna Kharge. His joining ceremony was held at the BJP headquarters in New Delhi, where the party leaders and parliamentary affairs minister Parla Joshi inducted him into the party and giving a speech at the ceremony. Kiran Kumar already said that he never imagined that he would leave the Congress Party. Uh, he took a will, uh, you know, jaip at the Congress uh, High Command and said that there is a saying, my king is very intelligent, he doesn't think on his own and he doesn't, uh, he doesn't let anyone's, uh, you know, ad anyone's advice, this is what he said. And UN Minister Parla Joshi said that several members of Kiran Kumar's family were in Congress and lauded the former Andhra Pradesh Chief Minister's decision to join the Bharati Janta Party and he also said that, uh, you know, he will strengthen our fight against corruption because his image as an MLA and the minister has been very clean. It will be a big boost for the Bharati Janta the party in Andhra Pradesh is what said and uh, Kiran Kumar already has resigned from the Congress party in 2014 to but you know to protest against the UPA government decision to bifurcate Andhra Pradesh and uh, you know play about Telangana he formed his own party uh, Jai Samai Kyandra and even fielded the candidates in some constituencies in 2014 elections and uh, however with no uh, no electoral gains the former CM stayed away from politics for a long time before he rejoined the Congress party again and 2018 and uh, the bifurcation of Andhra Pradesh came at a heavy price for the Congress and there was a mass exodus of party leaders follow, uh, following uh, the division and a grand old party has not been able to win, win a single Lok Sabha or Assembly seat in Andhra Pradesh since then. Madhu, how is this likely to tip uh, you know the scales in uh, favour of the BJP? You know, they are hoping to make inroads before the elections next year. 
yes yeah, see this come uh, this is a very important uh, you know uh, you know this is very important now that the, you know kiran kumar reddy starts campaigning uh, you know in andhra pradesh on behalf of bjp because so far in bjp there was not a single candidate who was strong enough to compete against the tdp and ysrcp and janasena party itself because we've also heard rumors that pawan kalyan might uh, you know tie hands might come in alliance with the part with the party on the other side we've also been uh, you know listening that there, there were reports which which said that tdp might also you know join hands with the bharatiya janata party but bharatiya janata party uh, uh, earlier uh, you know uh, andhra pradesh uh, chief uh, uh, you know he also said somo viraraj who said that uh, bjp will not go you know in alliance with any party be it janasena tdp or any other parties what they have clarified and congress party still doesn't have a chance in andhra pradesh because there is not a single LM, uh, mla that has been elected and also earlier when rahul gandhi has visited uh, you know andhra pradesh for his bharat jodo yatra as it was on route he had clearly mentioned that party needs to get stronger here in south and particularly in andhra pradesh and uh, you know telangana leaders were also asked to give pass on the suggestions to the other you know the congress party in andhra pradesh but being uh, you know kiran kumar reddy on the bjp side looks like you know andhra pradesh uh, bharatiya janata party might get to you know stronger this uh, this year as uh, jagan uh, mohan reddy's government is also you know uh, has began the campaign already and tdp is also uh, you know on the campaigns and uh, janasena party is also on the campaign right uh, madhu have we had an official reaction from the congress party in andhra pradesh uh, as to this particular move See, so far the congress party has not responded but the apcc's president uh, you know is holding a, a you know internal meeting with all the you know apcc leaders and their further course of action will be announced later tomorrow and also they are uh, trying to you know talk to uh, they are also inviting aicc members to come to andhra pradesh and you know uh, you have a, a strategy meeting is what we've got from the sources and madhu let us not forget uh, you know this is uh, Uh, the, the the second exodus for uh, the congress party after anil anthony the son of congress veteran uh, from kerala ik anthony is the second from south india uh, you know can we see a new lease of life that the bjp is trying to infuse into their campaign in south india Yes, see, definitely, because there is, an, uh, you know, BJP needs to get stronger in southern sta- southern states of, uh, you know, India. And uh, Kiran Kumar Reddy, the 62-year-old politician, you know, is very much, uh, you know, having a, you know, uh, he's, he's having a huge traction in this particular Andhra Pradesh because when he was the chief minister, he hailed from, uh, you know, Rayal Sima. He hails from Rayal Sima region, uh, to, you know, he, you know, which, which is expected to strengthen the Bharatiya Janata Party presence in the area and has considerable influence. He also, uh, pro- you know, he also be projected. He could. also be projected as a potential chief ministerial candidate by the bharatiya janata party is what we are expecting and uh, you know which is attempting to emerge as a third alternative in the state for more such videos subscribe to the newsx youtube channel hit the bell icon